Hey my beauties, so welcome back and if you all are new here, welcome to the channel. So for today's video, I have a cute little drugstore makeup haul. I did pick up some new drugstore makeup. The drugstore has been killing it lately with the new drugstore makeup. You know we love affordable makeup over here. So I wanted to pick up a few things and e.l.f. has really been killing it. So I picked up a few items from e.l.f. Um, I did place an order on e.l.f. and then majority of everything else I got inside the store. I do plan on picking up some more drugstore makeup so be on the lookout for another makeup haul because for some reason my Target by my house they wanted to be on their A-game and stock up the shelves because normally the makeup section at my Target be dry for some odd reason but they had all the new new so let's get into it make sure you guys grab a snack a drink and some dinner whatever and let's get into this haul have my stuff in this here bag so let's get into it i'm just going to randomly take things out okay so the first product that i have here is from elf this is the elf brow laminating gel and this is a three-in-one applicator so you get a comb and a brush duo and of course the product so i see mixed reviews on the website so i was going to get it on the website but then for like i said target <laughs> stocked up at my store so i was like let me just go ahead and get it now so this is what it looks like wait a minute oh the gel does it come out the brush or oh okay slow <laughs> you gotta twist it open and then here's the product so i don't know if it's tacky or not laminating i don't know so it's tacky so it kind of mimics like you know like some brow glue i never did the laminating brow look i guess it's no different when you use the um Oh, it's really tacky. I think this would be good for people with a lot of brow hairs. I probably wouldn't use so much of this just because of the consistency. It's really, really tacky. I don't, you guys can see that right there. Uh, because I feel like it would be hard for the eyebrow pencil to go over this hair product. Um, now, pomade might be different, but for sure, an eyebrow pencil might be hard to go over. But I know that's not the point. The point is to have that laminated brow look, which... I don't need to do I don't have enough brows to do but I'm just gonna play around with it and see how I can use it for my brows the next thing I have here are some nails from kiss like I told you guys in my vlog I am a French tip girl I like this style here but it's another style that I like the tip is like way skinnier than this that one is my absolute fave it goes with everything I just love it and they're short so like I said nowadays I'm just into the short nails the shorties so i did get the real short style from kiss they only had one pack left or else i would have got another one i forgot that maybelline came out with some lip liners and i was shocked once again that my target had this because they just take them a while to bring out the new stuff i don't know what's going on i feel like ever since target um remodeled like years ago and they kept remodeling they don't get a lot of their new products because I used to work at Target for like five or six years and I was able to get first of dibs on a lot of new product. I mean, so much new product was coming in, but they kind of slowed down on that and for whatever reason, but yeah, ever since they remodeled, they just like, you know, they're taking their time with the new stuff. So I was excited to see all of these items. With that being said, this is the Maybelline Lifter Liner. And I got the darkest shade. And this is the shade Cross the Line. I think these came out like a month or two ago. So it's still um, freshly new. Um, I hate <laughs> this packaging. I, I don't like sharpening these kind of pencils. But, ooh, it's really nice and creamy. Okay, that's nice. This is kind of like, it looks, I don't know why I looked at burgundy for a second, right? Um, but it's brown. This is a brown shade, but it's like a warm brown, as you guys can see when I do like this. Okay, that's nice. I think they had another brown shade. It looked brown to me. Um, so maybe I'll try that one out, but they don't have a lot of colors that I will wear, so... Of course, brown was the only option. This was on clearance for like $2.50. So I just went ahead and picked it up. This is the Elf Lip Exfoliator. Um, I already took it out the package, but I should have just left it there because this is 
coffee scent and I don't really like anything that's too like I don't really like anything that's coffee scent or chocolate on my lips or anything like that I just I rather not um, I haven't smelled this yet so let's see yeah see oh no ma'am I mean it feel like it'll do what it's supposed to do but maybe it won't be so strong on the lips if you guys have this so let me know but I, I, knew, I knew better I knew better but I picked it up it's just I can't I took this out the packaging as well already and I already swatched this this is the Luna magic blush I don't know if all targets have this brand but the target by me they have this brand called Luna magic now I do have a palette from this brand and it made it to my declutter but I decided to change my mind and like Brianna give it a try first because it's swatch amazing so I decided to keep that palette I believe I think I, the pigmentation on it is amazing so I need to try it on the eyes <laughs> um, but anyways they kind of expanded their little section at the target near me seeing that they had blush so I went ahead and I picked up this really really pretty bright deep pink shade absolutely gorgeous so pretty so let me go ahead and swatch that for you all like look at that oh my god I want to say they have more colors like maybe two other shades but and I'm trying to I think they had highlighters I don't know if I've seen bronzers or not one more product from Luna magic I picked up this palette I will say the palettes are a little pricey this was $14.99 and I want to say the other palette was $14.99 but the colors I'm a sucker for I love these shades this palette is called private access they had a few other palettes but you know they're $15 on it yeah <laughs> one at a time one at a time got this palette for obvious reasons because it's a neutral palette Ooh, i love how big the pants are and this screams like fall like this is really giving me like a nice everyday fall palette i'm so excited about this Ooh, those are the colors really really pretty and everything else that I got is from elf so <laughs> let's just get right into it so I picked up the elf ultra precise brow pencil this is my absolute favorite brow pencil I only got one more left because I I picked up a bunch of these pencils um, I think like Marshalls and TJ Maxx because you know that's where they send all the stuff that they're discontinuing or whatever so before they changed it they had it it was dark brown but they changed it to brunette and I'm sitting here waiting for them to maybe restock or whatever come to find out they changed the name to brunette so I was like let me just go ahead and pick this up I don't know if dark brown is still on the website but anyways I just picked this up I already swatched it or whatever so that's the color it looks it's see it's different from my dark brown because that looks really like warm a little bit but I'm gonna try it but I'm gonna be sad because I don't think it's my dark brown because I only got one left like why would y'all get rid of that but anyways other than that this is a really nice brow pencil so this is a new product from elf this is the elf bronzing drops this just released not too long ago i believe and i was not interested i was not interested at all and i did not need this at all because i have a like body shimmer body bronzing i have something from elf i think it came out with like a I think it came out with a collection or something and it is in a pump I have a full bottle of that I think I found it at like Burlington or something and so I thought about that today I was like I didn't really need this because I already have something like this but eventually I would have bought it because somebody probably would have influenced me so I went ahead and got it this is in the color bronze too so they had different colors so I was like let me just try a bronzy shade first and once again, Target was fully stocked, so I was shocked they had this. So I was like, what? You all never get new stuff in here. At least that Target I go to. I can't tell if the bottle itself is this color or if this is the product. But anyways, like I said, I got the color. Wait. 
do I got the I think I got the color pure gold but at the top it says bronze too so I don't know child but anyways you can use this um you can add one to three drops and you can use it in your favorite moisturizer your face oil or your body cream of choice and so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use it for my body. I'm, I'm not going to mix it in my face products because your girl is already oily. I don't need no extra glimmer. <laughs> so I'm just putting some on my hand so we can swatch it. Oh, yeah, that looks nice. OK, wait, that's not what I was. That's not what I was. Wait a minute. That's why they had different colors. I don't think this is what I thought. <laughs> I seen somebody try this on, I think, and I think she was a little confused too. Wait a minute. What is this? Okay. What? If you're my skin complexion and you picked this up, what color did you get? I don't know what the hell I just bought, but I got it. So. <laughs> we we gonna play around with it but for sure i don't think i'm putting that on my face super excited about this the next product from elf this is the elf pout clout lip plumping pen now these little pen products the the pen lip products i was not interested in this type of stuff when it came out was makeup by mario the first did they have something similar i'm not sure but anyways i know nyx I don't know I feel like gimmicky stuff like this I just don't pay attention to but I tried the ones from the beauty supply store and I fell in love I absolutely love them so now I want to try the ones from NYX and then I seen that elf has some but I tried the ones from kiss that I got from the beauty supply store I love them I love them I love them I love them so I'm like okay the elf is probably good I got the color toasted yes i really like these um i really like the one from the beauty supply store so i was hoping this one would give the same energy because at first i'm like i don't want i don't i'm confused so you just click it up like so i mean it takes a little bit but and then it just has like a lip balm lip gloss kind of consistency hope it gives what the ones from the beauty supply store that I that I'm raving about so much <laughs> so yeah that is the color toasted so I'm excited to try that but for sure with a lip liner with it without I'm gonna try so this is also a new product elf came out with some new shades in their elf lip plumping gloss absolutely love these lip glosses I might need to toss out mine and get some fresh ones <laughs> but you know how we do <laughs> we just be keeping stuff longer than we supposed to this one I was excited about I only got one I think they had a, a few more shades but this shade is called chocolate hold on let me see and, and it's so small like how you expect for us to tell people okay chocolate glaze like you need I need my glasses honey I'm supposed to tell y'all what the shade is and it's small anyways this reminded me of Fenty hot chocolate shade for some reason y'all it's so pretty it's called chocolate glaze this is for sure new because i love these elf lip products the lip plumping i love them so i know this is new because i ain't seen this one this is the elf sun boss gloss once again i was shocked they had these but i already ordered mine online so i didn't remember what shades i got online so i couldn't pick up the other ones that i didn't get in the stores because i didn't remember um, but these are the three shades that i end up getting and let's go ahead and swatch all three of them these are new i also have spf 25 the shade i have is it's your mauve it's your mauve it's like a pretty color. I don't really like mauve lip glosses. I don't know why. For some reason, they just don't look right on me. Y'all remember that, you know, era where mauve was the color? But this one kind of looks like a, a muted mauve. So maybe I can get away with it. This is the packaging. Let me show you. Super cute. Okay. That color's not bad. It's right here. The next shade I got is Blush Much. That's pretty. 
that's the color right there i'm gonna like that one i'm gonna like that shade i thought it was gonna be like a really pigmented like pinky nude color but it's it looked like it's buildable so i'll probably do like a light sheer kind of you know moment but yeah i like that it's it still gives you pigment but it's still kind of like sheer at the same time so i i do like that i feel like i'm gonna like that color and then the last one is called peachy peachy keen right here it's kind of like a peachy apricot looking color so i don't know it's probably be it probably look good with like a brown lip liner so yeah those are all the colors from elf that i got and last but not least the main purpose of my elf purchase was to get the new foundation i was going to skip out on it but i've seen a few people try it on so this is the elf soft glam satin foundation i got the shade 53 deep neutral i was going to order two shades but i'm like i ain't got time i really don't um i don't feel like returning nothing i'm not gonna return nothing i'm just not a return stuff kind of girl it just depends some stuff i will but no, so I just picked up a shade that I felt like is I got I got to make it work. So <laughs> we're gonna see. I can probably can almost do a full face of Elf. <laughs> I don't think I have, and I think I can. So we'll see what I got. We'll see what I can what I can do. But anyways, that's everything that I got from the drugstore. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And let me know if you picked up some of these products. And if you like what you see on my channel, make sure you guys subscribe and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.